I'm lounging with the one and only Usher. What's happening, man? You good? So, Mark, how you doing, man? How you doing? Cool, can't complain. So, what are we here doing, man? So, we are here in the uh, uh, Cricket Wireless Lounge. Uh, this is an opportunity for me to have an up close and personal, very intimate show with some of my fans. Amazing. Yeah. Cricket Wireless Lounge and your music, man, it's, uh, it just feels like it's connected. Um, well, I don't know if you know much about what I do as a philanthropist. I really do try my hardest to empower youth, and that's what I think uh, Cricket Wireless is doing. Mm. Uh, really giving youth, or young entertainers, African-American entertainers specifically, uh, a voice and an opportunity to be able to connect with their fans. And um, I'm really about that. I'm all about the empowerment of our young future leaders. How proud are you of Justin and the man he's become? Very. I mean, I'm also too equally, you know, challenged because I've seen him go through some very, very uh, complicated times. But um, always happy uh, when he, you know, decides to come back to what it is that he loves and not, um, you know, falter in that. Yeah. It's very hard. You know, you don't understand the pressure. It just seems like, oh, it's so great to have these lights and these cameras and all these people staring at you. That seems like such the beautiful thing, but the pressures that come with that and the reality of how hard it is to live under that type of scrutiny is a lot. So the fact that he's been able to manage to make it back to put out another album and share yet another piece of his life, I'm happy for y'all, man. I hope that y'all enjoy it. You're hosting the iHeartRadio Awards said it. and I'm performing. I'm so freaking nervous, bro. I ain't gonna even lie. <laughs> I'm, I'm, Why I've are you never, so nervous? Because I've never done anything like this. I like to talk a lot, as you can see. But um, <laughs> I, it's very complicated to be under that pressure to just, you know, entertain in that way. You know, but I do plan on making it a, a party, Usher's party. Yeah. Usher style. So you're going to be more nervous for the hosting than you are the performance on the night? <sighs> Performing, that's it's just nothing. Like getting out of bed, right? I, but yeah, no, it'll be it'll be great. Cause I mean, here's the beauty of it, right? Um, I'm fans of most of the people who are on the stage, and obviously Justin, really excited about him. Always been supportive of him since the, since you know the beginning of his career. Well, you're his so, mentor, right? Yeah, yeah, and and his friend. And his friend too. You know, but greater than his mentor, just his friend. And and watch him watch that metamorphosis uh, of an incredible person happen in front of the world. Um, but I do feel like, oddly, and like I, once I said yes to John Sykes, I'm like, yeah, okay, let me think about it. When you know, when you hear from me, that's when you know it's real. And I, you know, waited and waited and waited till I finally said yes. And when I looked at the lineup, I'm like, man, this so feels like what my party would be like. Who would be at a party of mine? Yeah. So it felt like the universe just lined it up perfectly. And I feel like it's really gonna be an amazing moment, but I ain't lying, I'm, I'm a little nervous about it because of the anticipation and the fact that I just want it to be, I want it to be, I want everything that I do to be great, but I, I, wanna, I wanna knock this one out the park. Yeah. I gotta talk about the movie, man. Yeah. A long time coming, uh, we can't wait. It's already won an award before it's even out. Burden. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Burden. Uh, what does it mean to you? I, I heard it's very precious to you. What, what does this movie mean to you? I mean, everything. Um, not only because uh, it's a, a meaningful piece of work. I think that as an actor or as all actors feel, they're looking for something that they feel is moving culture forward, but also to uh, imitating life in a real way. And this is a story that actually is imitating a real thing that took place. You know, racism, hatred, is not something that babies are born with. Yeah. They're taught to be that way and we all are a product of our environment. And this is a story about a guy who has um, really went through a series of things and found, him way to re found his way to redemption through love. Can we uh, just finish quickly with yep. a little game? Yep. It's a finish the sentence game. A little water, it's cool. Yeah, right. for sure. Finish the sentence game, right? Okay. So I'm gonna say a sentence, you're gonna finish it. Mm -hmm. If I was not singing, I would be. Trying to sing. <laughs> <laughs> I have a phobia of? I have a phobia of um, losing my teeth. Losing your teeth? I don't know. You have these. Do my, you have, you, my grandma lost her teeth. Am I yeah, the, young? What are you trying to say? No. <laughs> I'm just saying yeah. that's the person I know who's <laughs> <like> that <teeth. laughs> No, but at some point, I don't know what this means. Like when you have these dreams and your teeth are either falling out or either you're pulling yeah, them yeah. out or something. It's weird. Have right? you Googled what it means? No, and I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> I cannot get enough of time in a day. Don't you wish that you just had like a few more yeah, hours goes, every day? It goes too It quick. goes by too fast. And the older you get, the faster it goes. That's true. Or not, that's man. true. Yeah. Uh, my favorite cheat food is. 
Favorite cheat food. Ooh. Okay. Candy. Period. Candy, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My favorite cheat is red Australian licorice. Nice. That is nice. I love the Jerry's best. Yeah, but have you ever had no, I red think I have. Australian licorice? No, you need to get me some. Yeah, I'll hook you up. It's <laughs> great. <laughs> All right, the show I'm you. currently binging is? Uh, let me see. Uh, Insecure. Okay, nice. Yeah, good. Yeah. yeah, it's really good, yeah. Last <laughs> one. My most... Oh, no, we're not going to do that one. Um, Usher, it's so good to see you, man. Thank you so much. No, what's the last one? Go. Cool. Yeah, you want me to? Okay. Yeah. My most starstruck moment was when? Starstruck moment was when I met Prince. That was okay. my most starstruck moment. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.